Hey, what's up, Bree? Uh, I'm just going to record this instead of typing it to you because it might take me a while to get uh, stuff typed out. So I'm just going to record it, answer your questions. That way, we'll have a video that you can watch. Uh, all right. So here, first question: uh, general information about myself. Uh, I'm Adam Minton. I am 22 years old. I'm a, uh, at the moment, more of a commercial photographer. Although I'm getting ready to get in the realm of. Um, uh, wedding photography with uh, kind of a background in stock photography as well. How did I grow up? Uh, I was pretty much a quiet kid. I never really, uh, I played baseball and that was about it and just because it was it was a very laid back game and later playing golf. Um, pr yeah, pr I pretty much just like hung out by myself all the time. I had an older brother but he was like seven years older than I was, so we didn't really hang out that much. So I pretty much just kind of hung out, and did my own thing, um, and and ever since I was little, I could uh, I remember like seeing certain things that the way they looked, I was really interested in. Like I remember having this police car, it was like a little police car thing, and the uh, the tail lights on it looked so cool. I mean, I think it was just the combination of the color and where it was placed. It was like I really liked that. So and I always loved to draw and and all that fun stuff. So I think that kind of what got me interested in into art, um, and then I never really knew the options of photography. I just, I just thought it was photography was just kind of a cheap thing. You just, you know, you just take pictures and that's it. I didn't really know what all went into it and what all was behind it, and uh, so, so even from, I think from seventh grade is whenever I heard about graphic design. I thought about you know I'd, I'd like to do graphic design. Uh, I heard it from an art teacher. And uh, yeah, I thought that was really cool that you can make billboards and advertisements and stuff and, and make money from it and make a lot of money. And I thought that was really cool. So from, from about seventh grade on, I, I really wanted to pursue that as a career. Until um, until in high school, I started doing uh, video editing. And I thought that was my calling. I, I really liked it. I was in skateboarding at the time. So we did a bunch of skate videos and stuff like that, and I would uh, uh, kind of edit video from that, and, and it was a lot of fun. I really enjoyed it. And then in that class, I um, won some awards, and, and I really thought uh, video was, was what I was going to be doing um, for a living. And then I heard about the uh, WCC graphic design program from a friend who was going to do it. And the only reason I got into it was because they said that they might have a video class. So I said, I'm in. If there's going to be one video class, I'll do it. Um, so it got into graphic design and really liked it. It was a lot of fun and I had an eye for it. And, and then from there, we had some photography classes and that's when I started picking up in photography and, and looking at a lot of photographers like Jeremy Cowart and Chase Jarvis, Zach Arias. Um, Annie Leibowitz, a couple really, really good photographers that make a good living and, and do a really good job. I really started to appreciate their work more. Uh, and then, and then that one thing led to another. Next day, I'm at, you know, doing it for a living. Uh, all my jobs revolve around photography, and I love it. Next question: What got you interested in photography? Well, same thing. Um, went to Wilts, and I think. The first thing that got me really into it was I went to Staples and I picked up an SLR for the first time. And it wasn't a point and shoot, it was like an actual SLR, it was a little Rebel XCI and I, or XT, and I loved it, fell in love with it. I was like, I gotta have one. So put an order in at B&H and then uh, borrowed some money, paid it back, and went from there. So, what was your experience like at WCC concerning photography, concerning photography and graphics? Uh, I think as far as design goes, I mean, I think it's a really good program. Uh, I learned a lot of stuff. Um, and I think in the program, I, I don't think that they necessarily pushed people hard enough. So I was always like, okay, I've got to do better because I don't think I'm going to get a job out of out of this if I don't do this well. So I pretty much just lit a fire and, and try to do the best I could I looked online and try to find other resources and stuff that I really liked and uh, found what kind of style I liked and then I just kind of went from there 
uh, concerning photography. Uh, I mean, the program's kind of lacking with photography. I mean, it, it gets covers your basic, like uh, just your aperture and your ISO and shutter speeds and stuff, but they they don't talk about stuff like chromatic aberration. They don't talk about studio lighting. Um, they don't talk about a lot of post-process work. Um, so, and and you don't develop film, which I think is is very important to know how film is developed. Um, so I mean, it's kind of lacking. I mean, it was a good you know boost. It got me started, uh, and it got me some credit to Appalachian, so that's fine by me too. So, yeah, let's go on to the next question here.